Okay, good afternoon, parents, students, and everyone. Welcome to Lahug Night High School LBM Orientation. Learning Delivery Modality Orientation for Parents and Students on the implementation of the distance learning. All teachers are requested to come on September 29, 2020 at 1 p.m. in the afternoon for the dry run to see if all the teachers are prepared and ready for this coming October 5, the starting of distribution of the modules for the students. All advisors, with the help of the special teachers, will carry bring to the classroom all the needed materials for the dry run, such as attendance sheets. These attendance sheets will be used for all of the parents and the students sheet sign on. And then the teachers will bring the student learning materials module one. And then the sprayer with the alcohol so that all of your hands will be clean. And then teachers will put the signage for the safety protocols. Then outside the classroom, you will see the student list. Make sure that your name is inside the student list. If your name is not there, so it means that you belong to the other section. And there will be a plastic envelope for all of the modules according to all the subject areas placed inside the plastic envelopes. Okay? And then face shield, face mask, and there will be a box prepared by the advisor for contact tracing form will be placed inside the box. Okay? Okay, printing and sorting of student learning materials module 1 were already sorted and inserted in the prepared expanded envelopes ready for distribution. And then the module 2 will be ready for sorting with the help of the special teachers that this will be distributed the next week. Schedules of distribution and retrieval of outputs. Distribution of student learning materials printed or soft copy will start on October 5 at 2 p.m. But teachers will report on or before 1 p.m. so that they can prepare all the needed materials and, and then paste it inside the classroom. The distribution of student learning materials in print and soft copy will be done quickly. Parents, guardians, and students always remember that your answers will be separated on a separate sheet of paper. So, when you are going to answer your modules, please prepare a sheet of paper for your answers. Student learning materials will be retrieved at the end of the school year. So, meaning every week you will receive a modules module so you will compile every module and then it will be returned after a year okay all answer keys in the printed student learning materials has been removed 
if you notice that there are answer keys in the module, so inform your advisor so that it will be removed directly. Okay? So copies of the student learning materials must be converted first word format in order to delete all the answer keys. So those who will receive soft copy and use and saw that there are still an answer sheet for the advisor so that it will be deleted directly. Okay? Now the schedule of distribution and retrieval outputs always remember only two days in a week the distribution of the modules and the retrieval of the output. First, it depends upon your passes. If you pass ending add numbers, meaning 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, that those are the add numbers. We go to this we go to school every Monday at 2 p.m. So when you have the few pass in the add numbers, go to the school and then collect your modules every Monday. While those few pass in the even numbers will go to the school every Tuesday. Okay? Teachers will only come on the day of the student learning materials distribution, meaning the teacher, your teacher advisor will also go to the school every Monday and Tuesday. Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, you cannot see your uh, advisor. Even you will see your subject teachers, they cannot give you the modules. Only the advisors are allowed to give the module to the students. Okay, both advisors and subject teachers should know who among of their students are printed modular distant learning or digital modular distant learning. For them to prepare the number of student learning materials ready for distribution and who among of their students will be given soft caps. So, if you are printed modular distance 30, you will receive the printed cap. And when you choose the digital modular distance learning, so you will receive the soft cap. So, we will identify which one is EMDL or which one is EMDL. Okay? Students who prepare digital will be given free SIM with free mobile data, good for three months. As to the distribution of the SIM, we know not yet, but when it arrives, we will distribute it directly. To check, verify the grade level, parents, guardians, especially the transfers, new students to bring or submit the hard copy or the soft copy of the credentials needed. Form 137, the NSO, the card, so those are the needed credentials for them to be officially enrolled in the level. Okay? They will submit that together with their first output from the module 1. Platforms for online, digital, offline distance learning. All teachers are required to create any platform for the delivery of instruction and communication of the learners, parents, guardians. So, all the teachers created the platform in order to communicate with the parents. Those are the group chat, 
the Zoom meeting, Google Meet, and the Google Classroom, and other platforms. So, there is no reason for the students and teachers that you could not communicate with them. Teachers are encouraged to conduct virtual meetings to those who prefer digital modular distance learning or online modular distance learning of at least once a week, 30 minutes or one hour every virtual meeting. These are the purpose of it is to clarify and further explanation of the lessons student learning materials. Okay. Platforms for online, digital, offline distance learning. Preferably, the virtual meeting be done in the morning or on the days the teachers are not to report. Meaning, the teachers will report, your advisor will go and report every Monday and Tuesday. So the teachers will not report in every Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday. That is your advisor. So the advisor will conduct a virtual meeting once a week in the morning. But this is not compulsory to the students, especially those who do not have the internet access. Okay? Teachers are highly encouraged to upload supplemental video, audio, lessons to the group chat and Google Classroom. So, expect those who are online digital learning. Teachers will upload a supplemental video that everyone can access. Audio lessons or any, any supplemental the video that, that will help the student understand more about the student learning materials in the book. If there are conflicts in the schedule of Google Meet and the other teachers, please inform your teacher advisor so that they, they can give away and then plan for another schedule. Okay? Full health and safety protocols. This is very important for entering the classroom. Parents and students should follow the safety protocols. Okay. In the school, there will be two gates, the entrance and the exit. The entrance you can find is near the sky, and the exit is in the gate near the sped belt. There are two entry points lanes in the entrance gate. So in the entrance gate, there are two points lanes. school guards. This is the policy before you enter the campus inside the school. No face mask, no face shield, no entry. Very clear. Okay? And then number two, physical distancing of at least a meter apart. Okay? Number three, pass through a foot bath and disinfect the hands using the alcohol. Temperature check using the non contact infrared thermometer. Those with body temperature of 37.5 degrees Celsius and above will stay outside and will undergo a recheck after two minutes. If it is still 35, and 37.5 degrees Celsius and above after your rechecking, he or she is, no, is not allowed to enter the campus. Okay? Number five, get one copy of the contact tracing form. The contact tracing form will be submitted 
in the box prepared by the advisor. In the advisor's room, the parent's guardian will sign in the student learning monitoring form using his or her own booklet and pick one plastic envelope consisting all student learning materials in all subject areas. Okay? In succeeding weeks, the parents will bring the plastic envelope consisting the outputs, place the place the outputs inside the expanded envelope provided in the advisor's group and pick get another modules intended for that thing and place it inside his or plastic envelope. Okay? Teachers are teachers, school personnel with vehicle will use the exit gate gate but still undergo temperature check with the utility personnel as the attendant. So when you bring your motorcycle and your car, so you will pass through the exit gate and then have a temperature check. Okay? Other matters, all teachers must prepare the learner's daily learning lab give it to the learners printed on soft copy on the first week of the month and claim it on the last week of the month. Okay, so every first week of the month, the student will receive the learner's daily learning plan. So this is the monitoring of how you answer the movies. So you write it down to your daily learning plan. So you will receive this every first week of the month and you will submit this every last week of the month. Okay? Good. So I think that's all. Thank you for sharing your time. Okay? This video will be uploaded to your our Facebook account, Facebook group. And also, every time you get the module every week to, to review the video so that you will be guided and you will know what to do every time you go to the school for safety purposes. Okay? Good luck guys!